What is going on, everybody? So check this out. My son, Steven, decided to come down and visit. Only for the simple reason that this video goes back to mini season where we had a bunch of lobster and some tuna that we caught. And I called him up and I said, hey man, I know you didn't get to go with us. So if you want, come down and I will cook this stuff up for you. And he did. So basically this is an old video that I dug up out of the archives and uh, figured that I might as well put it out. Hope you enjoy it guys. Thanks for watching. Hi Dash. Look who's here. There's Steve-O. That's, That's Junior. My, my son. Yeah. He was like, uh, you got lobster tails? Yeah, I'm not missing Tuna? I want some of that. It's a good way to get me down here. Yeah, heck yeah. You're only cooking four of them? We Whatever. Might need, we might need a few more. Got my oven set at 400 degrees. A little bit of olive oil. Here, let's do this. I don't know how you do these because I cooked some the other night. Oh, that's right. I remember. Yeah. And swordfish as well, right? Yeah, swordfish and lobster tail. And I had clams. What kind of clams? A little neck. Oh, nice. So I've had sushi the past two days, so. Good for you, man. Not better. No. There we go. Okay. All right, so we get some pepper and then garlic, salt. Little bit of Lowry's. A little bit of pepper with the tuna. Himalayan salt. That's it. So what I'm gonna do is we're gonna start these guys first. Here we go. I'm gonna leave them on there for a couple of minutes. Mm. Throw them in the oven. Can go like somewhere by the ocean and they cook on the sea. Dude, that's what it smells like. Where'd you grow up going? Cape Cod. It smells good. Whole yeah. lobster, not yeah. just the tails. I was the last I was gonna ask. The spiny, you don't get any of the claws or the any of that. It is different. Yeah. But I'll tell you, you boil them whole. Fantastic. The color is coming up through. So let's throw them in that 400 degree oven. And we'll finish them off in there. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, watch. It's gonna happen quick. Look at how yeah, fast it, really it takes happens. Two seconds, yeah. yeah. So this you wanna sear quickly. You want to sear it on all three sides. See it creeping? We're going to roll it right like that. Let that cook. Is it creeping yet? Oh yeah, it's starting to creep. And then we're going to do this. No, this, is, this by far is my favorite fish I think ever. Close to salmon, but it doesn't really compare either. It's still better than salmon and swordfish. Oh yeah, fantastic. So High good. in mercury so though. So good. It is so good. I might have to go pick some up tomorrow. Yeah, swordfish is amazing. Let's see what the inside looks like. I'm hoping oh. for, oh, that's, <laughs> that is perfect. That looks good. <laughs> I, I think I just want to do wasabi on it. I'm not even going to put soy sauce. All right. Just because so I would normally would put soy sauce if it was like raw, but this I just want to do wasabi. All right, there's some. 
that fish was huge. Mm. Like butter, right? Yeah, it's like it just falls apart in your mouth. You don't have to do anything. That <laughs> I think the texture is why I like this fish so much. I, I really do, do. I agree. Texture is ninety percent of it for me. Yep. But these kids, you know, they were raised on raw clams and just things that most people are like. Yeah. Ugh! If you think something's gross, try it. Still, just give it a try, because you might end up liking it. Yep. I sushi is my favorite food now. The thought of it for some people is crazy, but it's yep. my favorite food. And they are about done. And I know I think he's... I'm more excited for those, but this is so good. <laughs> oh yeah, we will inhale those. Look at that, look at that. Can't get more simple. Mm. All right, careful, it's very hot. I'm not even exaggerating when I see this right now, but if I was on the electric chair, on my on death row, and this, I had to pick my last meal, this would be it. I'd probably get sick, but eating so much of it, but this would be it, yeah. <laughs> well, it doesn't matter if you get sick at that point. That's true. Uh, look at that. You know what you need? Some butter. butter. Take a bite. Thing. I'll get you some. That's hot. Is it good? Yeah, it's a little hot, but it's good. <laughs> I could eat all of this. Oh, me too. You grew up eating the entire lobster. Legs, tail, claws, and you used knuckles. To, you would eat, I'm talking every little juice that was hidden in that thing. Yep. Now this guy was getting ready to shed. You see the oh, red? Yeah, yep. There's two layers though. Yep, that's exactly right. That's crazy. There it is, there you, you go. got it. Got the salt and pepper still on there. <laughs> Amazing. I hope you got more of those. It's even cooler when you're catching them though. Mm-hmm. These two foods right here are the foods that you catch yourself being a messy eater, but you don't care. And you continue to shove your face full of it. Even if it's dripping down your face or you just ruined your shirt. Yeah, it doesn't matter. Yeah, it doesn't matter. Holy smokes. Hey girl, you're up. The seagulls woke up. Here they are. Anyways, thanks for watching. God bless. Keep your eyes peeled for that next video, guys, and we will see you then.